Hello Internet, I am the final boss and this is, I'm not sure if it's supposed to be a horror game or if it's just going to be a super serious game. I do know that this is going to be around 30 minutes long, more or less. I, I might be able to edit that. I didn't think it would happen so fast. One year, that's all it took. I never got to say goodbye. Oh, that's sad. Oh, am I playing now? I am. Uh, as I was saying, this game's going to take around 30 minutes. It looks like it's going to be a fairly serious game. Uh, that's about all I know. Let's go ahead and get into it and see what's going on. I don't remember what that name was. Am I supposed to be following these flowers? I assume I'm supposed to be following these flowers. Going down. Going down. Okay. Something to do with grief, I'd have to guess. Oh, we're going back to a year ago. We're going to see what happens. I love flashbacks. Left click. In ah, crap. I can't see what the entire screen says. So I can left click things. I can't believe it's been five years since we visited San Francisco. I keep promising we'll go on another trip, but my tour schedule always gets in the way. Perrin looks so happy here. Tour schedule? Coin jar? If we jar? tuck away Ooh. a little cash here and there, we can save up for an honest-to-god vacation. Someplace warm and sunny. Maybe Italy or Greece? Those are some really weird-looking coins. been nice taking some time off with Erin between touring. I'll have to hit the road again soon though. I'd take her along, but I don't think she'd like it. Touring isn't like travelling. Okay. No, nothing for bed? Yes, Erin. I finally got some new adult sheets for this new adult bed. I guess it was time to throw out my old tie-dye sheets from uni. <laughs> Oh, this is a game that actually has mirrors that work. I don't know why I'm so excited about that, but whatever. Nothing to uh, explore in the toilet. All right, uh, hmm. I'm not entirely sure what, I, I just need to look God, at anything. I miss home cooking when I'm on the road. Erin is a sorceress in the kitchen. It's a really big stove. Like, Really big stove. Erin oh. insisted that we needed a cheerful rug. You know, to tie the room together. I keep making that joke, but she's never seen the big Lebowski. We've got to see it together sometime. I don't get that joke either. I think Erin would have got enough of these the things working at a plant nursery, but she's turning our home into a greenhouse too. She says being around nature is good for your health. The girl's got a green thumb, that's for sure. She's named the fern, Jeremy. Jeremy the Fern. Well, crap, what am I? Oh, Officially boxes. Officially done moving in. Jesus, I'm tired. That's enough of lifting boxes for one lifetime. But hey, this place is really starting to look like home. Although most of the stuff is errands. Ah, here we go, super. My faithful psychic. We've been through a lot together, right, buddy? Uh, right, that should be it, right? I think that's it. I think we can, maybe, maybe we need to go back to the door. Oh, let's try it. Oh, yeah, that's it. Looks like the game's going to do most of the talking in this one, so if you don't like that, I understand. Ooh, it's a cave. With a bunch of broken pots. Olivia? Erin, are you alright? It's too late. You need to get out of here. No, I'm not leaving without you. Erin? Erin, I'm coming for you. What's going on here? Oh. Okay. At least you tried to have water. I'll give you that much. This is the weirdest 
little like dream sequence type deal that I I'm, I'm pretty confused I'm sure everything will I'll understand everything in time but right now I'm just pretty confused whisper whisper maybe it's through this giant archway that I sh totally should have seen but did not It's my trusty suitcase. Yeah, my guitar. What is in the darkness? Oh. I'm okay. home. Erin? Where is she? She knew I'd be back from touring today. Um, I like what they did with the place. Huh. It looks really nice now that they've got it all packed up and decorated. Some trees, a chef. Mm hmm. Oh, and everything's a lot less bright now. What do you got on your schedule? Live you home and pick up the candy. Wait. Oh, because it's, it's October, if that makes sense. Oh, God. Jesus Aaron? Christ. The fuck? Erin, um, what happened? Are you okay? I'm okay. Jesus, there's blood everywhere. Where are you? I'm at the hospital. Olivia, I need you to come here. What's going on? Are you hurt? I think we'd better talk in person. I'm on my way. Jesus, what happened? Oh. What's the sound of your voice? Erin, where are you? Remember when we first started dating? When you used to play songs for me all the time? I'd come over and sit on the bed because you didn't have any chairs. You'd play guitar and sing for me. Look, Erin, tell me where you are. I'm going to get you out of here. You were so romantic back then. I miss the days when you'd write songs for me. Erin, this really isn't the time. I need to find you. We never talked at the end. I just want to have a conversation. I'm literally going through hell for you, and you want to have a fucking chat about our courtship. Why won't you just talk to me? You never, you never communicate. All these years together, and I still don't understand how your mind works. I used to listen to you practice thinking, oh, that song sounds sad. Is, is she mad at me? You're reading too much into it. Or you'd play me something really beautiful. I thought maybe that was your way of saying you love me. I was, I was jealous of your guitar. You could go weeks without calling me. But when you were, you were making music, it was like you were speaking in another language. I just couldn't make sense of it. I don't want to talk about this right now. Why are you here, Olivia? What's this all for if you won't even show me some compassion? Am I just some empty goal for you to reach? Erin, we'll talk about this when I find you, but just... I'm doing my best here, okay? I don't need a guilt trip. Oh, Fine. I guess I just need to go into the water. So far, this has been really sad. Uh, probably some disease. I'm guessing I'm going to call it some disease, maybe even a form of cancer. I guess Greece will have to wait. How did we only catch the Sphinx so late in its development? I was right. The doctors have been talking about a hysterectomy, but they're afraid the tumor has spread into the rest of her pelvis by now. That really I wish sucks. there was something I could do. I feel so useless. I'm taking a break from touring for a few weeks. But the treatments don't pay for themselves. Honestly, this has been so much to process. I'm ashamed to admit it, but I'm a little grateful for the space when I'm on the road. Yeah, that's pretty sad. Losing someone because of cancer is... I feel like I'm never even home long enough to get used to sleeping here. What else is there here? One of these days, there's going to be something in the bathroom. So I'm not going to walk into it just to 
walk into it. I guess that's it for this movie. Uh, this memory. We'll move on. I don't know what these words are. Uh, yeah. I'm sure as hell I ain't gonna try and pronounce them. Those are the hardest months of my life. I was in pain all the time. I was afraid I'd die any minute. I know, Aaron. But the hardest part was going through it alone. I was suffering and you were never there. I wanted to be with you, really. Then why weren't you? You could have stopped the tour, easy. I didn't know how to help you. There was nothing I could do but sit around and feel anxious all the time. At least on the road, I felt like I was doing something useful. Besides, we needed the money. If it was about the money, we could have reached out to friends and family. I never asked you to do any of that. What did you do with me? I'm sorry, okay? I just don't see how I could have made any difference if I'd been at home. Made any difference? It would have made all the difference in the world. I thought if these were my last few months, I, I want to spend them with you. It would have been such a comfort just to know that if, if I died, you wouldn't be somewhere halfway around the world. I worried about that every day. And still, you didn't, you didn't just come home? It was so hard seeing you getting sicker and sicker. I felt like my heart was being crushed to bits. I know it doesn't compare to what you were going through, but I was suffering too, watching you get worse. I missed the girl who was full of life. I wanted to remember you like that. And coming to terms with the fact that I might never see that side of you again. I needed space to grieve. Olivia, it would have been easier to grieve together. Is that the end of that one? Oh! Do I need to like jump on the pills? No. That would have been an interesting little platforming thing. Oh my! Oh, pill bottles. Where am I going? Uh, not this way, obviously. That way it kind of caught on fire for us. Ah, it's probably that one. With all the pills. This one's gonna... No? No. Now I can't go that way anymore. Alright. Mazes suck. Jesus. Oh, I bet I can go straight here, can't I? I don't think I ever tried that. Yeah, I'm dumb. Alright. And... That's it. We ended the puzzle. The... Oh. I thought I wasn't supposed to go down there for a second. Two months ago. Erin? I thought she'd be home when I got back. What's this? What have you been up to? Oh. Cigarettes? No, you've got to be kidding me. What kind of idiot smokes around a cancer patient? I didn't think Aaron was even in contact with Varia anymore. Oh, never mind. I was wrong. What the fuck? What Did you want me to see this, Aaron? Well, if they slept together, at least they had the decency to do it somewhere other than our goddamn bed. Uh, all right. It's pretty awful. Is there anything else here that I missed? Nah, time to just exit the memory. Sticks. I know that one. It's Greek mythology. Were the rest of them also Greek mythology? Wait. Those weren't like the seven uh, circles of hell, were they? They might be. It's been a long time since I read Dante's Inferno. Ooh. Oh, this is from the... Uh... Whoa. That's disorienting. This is the the message. Oh, I wasn't trying to hurt you. 
Well, you've really fucked that one up. I was lonely. We were dressing apart and I needed to be with someone. Why turn to Aria? Why not your friends or your parents? I may have been sick, but I was, I was still human, Olivia. I, I wanted... I needed to be touched and she was there when I asked her to be. Aria doesn't care about you. And you do? Fighting through the underworld for my sake? All this, but you couldn't even be with me during the darkest time of my life? Whoa. You think having cancer gives you the excuse to fuck around behind my back? Do you have any idea how this feels for me? To feel this betrayed yet to miss you more than anything? I know exactly how it feels. I can't warn you properly like this. I want to feel sad, but I'm just angry at you. Nope. No, don't do that. Ah. Oh, okay. No, of course not. Why else would I do oh. Maybe you should have given that some thought. I'm not leaving you. I just wish you'd worked as hard to reach me when I was alive. So wait, this is supposed to be going on concurrently? But also kind of metaphorically? A form of grief, but also not. Is that a chicken or a heart? The world will never know. It's probably a heart. Anybody home? That's weird. Her purse is still here. Oh, she ran off with the... Uh... Aaron? Oh, shit. No. I thought she ran off with the... Uh... uh, is it... Ooh. This is it, isn't it? I mean, I'm sure there's going to be some sort of closure at the end of this, but... Unless that pond was like, I drowned myself. Oh, all the Aaron, flowers are dead is now. Is that you? It's over, Olivia. No, Erin. I, I did it. I'm here. What were you planning on doing once you found me? I'm dead. Then, then this was all for nothing? No. This is your chance to say goodbye. I don't want to say goodbye. I want to start over. We don't get that choice. Look, I, I was a ship partner when it came down to it. I was afraid of the pain. I shut you out and ran away. You deserve so much better. But I always loved you. I want- It's okay, Olivia. You don't have to feel guilty forever. Ah. And now I'm moving again. Oh, is that's that's the end of the entire game. I thought there might have been like a another epilogue chapter. I guess you could argue that this is the epilogue chapter. This is definitely not what I expected to get myself into. Whenever I download this game, I honestly thought it was just a horror game. Uh, nope. <laughs> just a sad, sad game about real issues. Am I supposed to be doing something here? Nice little. Well, thank you, game, for crashing. Ah, I hate it when games do that. Uh, well, I'd like to hear what you guys think about the game in the comments. We can talk about it. Um, I don't really. I feel like I'm not qualified to say anything about this game. Uh, I haven't had too many, too many personal tragedies. Definitely none involving cancer, but that. Is, I'm not qualified to say anything about this game, so I'm just going to go ahead and end the video. Uh, leave a like if you like this video, subscribe for more content, 
and I will see you next time.